Hey everybody, work in progress again. See, I'm just starting to do work toward the crown area now on little Jay. But the really exciting thing, my Liam got here. Liam is going to be a dragon skin baby when he is finished and I like this one. This is the one that um, is so mischievous. Um, one of my friends has a doll, a Liam sculpt that is named Mitchell and Mitchell is always getting into all kinds of trouble. He's got these nice chunky little hands. He's a little chub up. And this is actually the smaller of the two lambs. Um, I want to get the larger one also because I want to have a doll that has um, the ability to wear 12 to 18 months. And in that little toe, so cute, just sticking out like that. And it came with the body, of course. And so I've got just everything. I've got to make sure that I've got the right size eyes. Um, I'm going to have to order some more eyes. I think the eyes that I've got are just a little bit too small. But I think Liam is so adorable. And he's another one that actually could be done as an Asian baby because of the way his, his little eyes kind of tilt. Um, but anyway, so he's going to be my dragon skin baby in my collection. And I've got plans for other dolls, doll kits to get here in the near future. And some just regular dolls to add to my collection. Um, I wish that I was wealthy enough actually to afford some of the really nice kits and some of the sculpts from some of my favorite reborn sculptures, but I'm not, and I probably won't be. So I have to make do with either factory made dolls or low end um, kits. So. And making them myself, and and making them myself, I can actually I have a lot of fun doing it. I can make the skin colors, whatever skin colors I want, and you know I can I can decide the personality of the doll that, that is going to come come through, and it, it's just they 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 all have their own personality, and uh, it's like little Jay's all uh, little Jay is kind of. A really happy baby. Um, he's he's peaceful, content. And Robert Stephan was all full of awe and wonder. And Miss Alana Michelle is very happy and friendly. And little Tink, of course, was just full of giggles. So um, yeah, they all have they all have their personality, you know. The kids do and. And so whenever I get to working on them, it seems like that first sound just comes out more and more. And they sort of come to life when I'm painting them. So I'm looking forward to working on Liam and the Flora sculpt, those two, and getting into Because I'm really looking for Flora, especially because I wanted a little elf baby. So, and... Uh, And the reason this thing is shaking is I've got a cat. Here's Mr. Cookie Monster. And he has been <laughs> cleaning himself and wandering all over the table, making the table shake. shake. Because when he wants to, he can, he can be slightly a little bit of a klutz. He's a good boy, aren't you? Yes, he's a good boy. Okay, well, um... Email, mailing address, 
and Patreon page are in the description below. I love you all so much. You, I love having you as, as my YouTube family and friends. And um, hopefully by this time next week, the little J doll, the head will be finished and I can start working on putting them together. Although I may have to order some new eyes. We'll see. Um, you guys have a really nice day today. Talk at you later. Bye-bye.